Hey, cowboy. So you weren't aware? Yellowstone Season 5 Part 2 is set to premiere in November 2024, and it's been confirmed as the series' final season. Fans can't get enough of Taylor Sheridan's hit contemporary western, which has been a massive success on Paramount+. Yellowstone has even inspired two spin-off prequel series, 1883 and 1923, as well as an upcoming show called 6666 about Texas's Four Sixes Ranch. Season 5 Part 1 ended on a cliffhanger for the Dunn family. Rip and several ranch hands head to the Four Sixes in Texas to save their cattle, leaving Casey in charge of the ranch. Meanwhile, the rivalry between Beth and Jamie heats up as Jamie gains the upper hand by threatening to expose John's involvement in multiple murders. Jamie, with help from Sarah Atwood, hires assassins to outmaneuver his family, setting up an intense showdown. Season 5 Part 2 is shaping up to be the most shocking installment yet. After a lengthy wait through various delays, the latest news confirms the release date for Yellowstone Season 5 Part 2. The beloved neo-western is now officially slated to debut its final batch of episodes on November 10th, 2024, at 8 p.m. Eastern. There is no word on how many episodes the second half will have, but there will likely be eight total episodes, like Season 5 Part 1. That said, just a day after the release date for the final half of the season was revealed, Kevin Costner announced he wouldn't be back for Yellowstone Season 5 Part 2. The celebrated actor played John Dutton throughout the entire series up to Season 5, but his high-profile departure left many wondering if Yellowstone would even finish. Now, the Oscar winner has taken to Instagram to set the record straight and explain that he won't be back, nor will he ever reprise his role as John Dutton. In the clip, for fans, Costner also promoted his upcoming Western, Horizon, an American saga. While fans are undoubtedly disappointed by Costner's departure, the remaining episodes promise to deliver a gripping conclusion to the Dutton family saga. With so many loose ends to tie up and intense conflicts to resolve, the final chapter is sure to be a wild ride. In part one, when Beth discovers the train station, her immediate reaction is to tell John they need to kill Jamie. Meanwhile, Jamie is already plotting with Sarah Atwood to strike first. This season could see the battling without Rip, who is leading the ranch hands and cattle to Texas, possibly setting up the upcoming 6,666 spinoff. Jamie's attempt to impeach John looms over him, and John's conservation easement plan for the ranch is threatened by Jamie and Sarah's commercial ambitions. Meanwhile, Chief Thomas Rainwater, M.O., and Angela Blue Thunder from Broken Rock could still change the game, depending on how the Dutton's plans impact the federal government's pipeline project through the reservation. With all these tensions, Season 5 Part 2 promises an epic and bloody conclusion. Could Kevin Costner return for Season 5 Part 2? Costner has played a crucial role in every previous season of the Paramount Network drama, but whether John Dutton's storyline gets a proper conclusion currently remains up in the air. Reports of various behind-the-scenes issues have emerged over the past two years, suggesting a breakdown in the working relationship between Sheridan and Costner. Costner has denied much of what has been reported, but the points of contention seem to be Yellowstone's writing and production timeline and creative disagreements. Costner recently confirmed that he left Yellowstone because the show's long seasonal development pipeline and the delays in this process prevented him from working on any other projects in a given year. This would speak to a central point in some of the previous reporting about Costner's departure, which is that his role as part of the Yellowstone cast was impacting his ability to work on his Western passion project, Horizon, an American saga. Costner has, however, expressed an interest in returning and bringing closure to his character. While filming on Season 5 Part 2 is now ongoing, Costner is in the midst of production on Horizon, an American saga Chapter 3. It's unclear whether schedules will allow for his return. It's not known how long the Horizon shoot will go for, but it's possible that Costner will be able to squeeze in some filming for the Paramount Network show when that production is wrapped. Many questions still remain about Season 5 Part 2, but the final batch of episodes at least now has an official release date. Over the course of five seasons, Kevin Costner has been the face of Taylor Sheridan's hit neo-Western Yellowstone. However, now that his contract has ended and it seems likely he won't return, it's time to delve deep into the hints the Yellowstone cast has provided about how the series might conclude without its star.
At the end of 2022, the show premiered its latest installment, Yellowstone Season 5 Part 1, with the second part promised to be on the horizon. However, because of the recent SAG AFTRA strike, the series finale has been put on hold, and many questions remain about how it will end. Since Season 5 Part 2 hasn't been written yet, the show's possibilities are essentially endless. However, the final piece of the puzzle will have to pick up where Part 1 left off. Tensions are rising between Jamie and Beth as Jamie intends to run John out of office, and both siblings plan to have the other killed. Meanwhile, flashbacks show the Dutton Ranch's former glory, which is a stark contrast to it currently slipping through the family's fingers. Casey and Monica may be the Dutton's one last hope, but they may not step up. Ultimately, Season 5 Part 2 will see these pessimistic times brought to their final conclusion. The biggest question that remains about Season 5 Part 2 is whether Kevin Costner will return as John Dutton. As of now, the answer seems to be no. Costner was already set to leave Yellowstone after Season 5, but due to the delays in getting the second part made, it seems the iconic actor's contract has lapsed before the series end. For the most part, Costner has remained silent on the issue, and the majority of information about it has come from court documents released during his divorce. Namely, Costner noted that he would be making significantly less from Yellowstone in 2023 than he had in 2022. Most recently, Deadline revealed in a report that Costner had broken his silence on his Yellowstone exit, claiming that he would probably go to court because of it. It seems that Costner was promised two more seasons of the series, but the supposed deal never came to fruition, and as a result his contract has ended. In the end, though amid all these controversies and claims, the general answer seems to be that there is a strong possibility that Kevin Costner will not appear in Yellowstone Season 5 Part 2. When it comes to Yellowstone ending without Kevin Costner, the general consensus is that the series will most likely kill him off-screen. It is a solution that is thought of most often and surprisingly seems like the best path forward. Ending a series without its main actor can be a terrible situation, and handling it with care is of the utmost importance. In terms of Yellowstone, this is especially true. John Dutton is just as vital to the Yellowstone cast and characters as Kevin Costner is to Yellowstone as a series. Therefore, giving him an epic and dramatic end seems ideal. However, John Dutton's death will inevitably be an upsetting event, and without Kevin Costner to even perform his own demise, it could be a stilted moment. Killing John Dutton off-screen could come across as too sudden if executed poorly or empty without the star there to be his character. Overall, there are definite pros and cons to killing John Dutton in Season 5 Part 2. In general, it seems to be just one of many paths Taylor Sheridan could go down with this final installment. The other major solution to Kevin Costner's exit is making John Dutton leave the ranch altogether. In an interview with Insider, Beth Dutton actor Kelly Riley noted that when considering Yellowstone's ending, I'm not sure it will be happy. While this could point to the John Dutton dying theory, it could also be the simple fact of him leaving his ranch and, as a result, splitting the family apart. As for the Yellowstone ending, Riley also mentioned the main theme of protecting and sustaining this way of life in this land is the bottom of everything. It could be possible that, in order to protect his ranch, John Dutton needs to leave it. And that's that for today's video. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Your suggestions for future videos are always welcome in the comments below.